yes, yes. Another day, another Art lesson. lesson with Nick the Artist. This one is Circles 2. Cool, cool, cool. We'll be drawing, designing with circles. Oh, that's an emoji. I can do that. Fair so, enough. Get your paper, pencil, eraser, or your tablet. Mr. Nick, I can or draw that. Nothing but a little happy face. Let's get to drawing. Okay. Shall we? Okay. We okay. shall. Okay. Okay. I'm ready. So, most of my students know I start off my classes with about five to ten minutes of free draw. Free draw. Maybe you can draw or color, whatever you feel like. Just draw. Be creative. It's spring. It's springtime. Spring is in the air. It's spring. Draw a beach scene. How about draw a mountain and someone climbing the mountain? How about a car with draw a wheels. cow jumping over the moon? Ooh. And he has like a jetpack or something. Or he's super cow. He got like super power. How about an itsy bitsy spider? Well, it's time for free draw. Just draw whatever you want. Draw, draw. We'll start our lessons draw, soon. Draw, draw, draw. Hope you stretched today. Hope you got out in the backyard. Hope it's a wonderful day out here. Guys, looking beautiful. I'm outside, quarantined, six feet away. Stay back. Mask on. Mask on. Mask on. Hands washed. Yeah, it got scrubbed. At least 20 seconds. At least I'm 20 ready to seconds. teach. Are you ready to learn? I'm ready to learn. So just free draw. So yeah, just draw. Mm -hmm. Doesn't matter. Mm -mm. Or you can just rock to the beat. Mm -hmm. You know. Uh huh. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. Yeah. Uh huh. Uh huh. This lesson is brought to you on the iPad. I'm using Sketchbook Pro. Nice. I recommend that app. It's free, number one. Yes. There's so much you can do with it. Yes. Yes. If you don't have an Apple, you can get Sketchbook Pro for your Android tablet. Mm-hmm. You can order a stylus pen. Mm-hmm. Help with the drawings. Or, you can order a laminated sheet of paper from Staples or Office Depot mm -hmm. or FedEx Kinko's. For what? And use a dry erase marker. Ah, a little whiteboard. A little homemade whiteboard. <laughs> no. All right. I'm about to start this lesson soon. Up to you. I have other lessons online, so please subscribe. So you can keep up on. We'll start a lesson pretty soon. Lessons that so techniques. much you can draw with circles. This guy right here. Bloop, bloop, bloop. I said a bloop, bloop, bloop. That's finding Remo right there. Finding Remo. Finding Remo. So let's get ready. Get started. Give me a fresh sheet of paper. Mm -hmm. Okay. We're just gonna start off with like little circle clouds, you know. Okay. Little puffy clouds here. No such thing as an artist making Not a mistake. Too hard. Not too difficult. Puff puff. And then we're gonna let our imagination play. See what we can do to these clouds. What comes with clouds? Yep. Rain. 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 Chocolate rain. Uh -huh. Purple rain. Uh. Make it rain. Make it rain on ya. Get out your umbrella. All right. Mm -hmm. 
Nice, nice. Okay. That's cool. Alright, let's see what else we can do. Let's go ahead and erase that. Rain was cool. Mm-hmm. But it's a springtime, sunny day, so. Looking outside, all the birds. They're taking over. My head right on you. The earth is taking over. Draw some seagulls or something. Flying over the ocean, flying over the beaches that we can't go to. But it's okay, we'll be back. We'll be back. Don't worry. We'll be back. Yeah, I know. They just taking over. Ooh, watch, watch it here. Watch, watch it. it here. Watch, watch it. it. Watch it. Oh, I just stepped yeah, in it. I just stepped in it. That is a bomb. They are dropping bomb. My shoes watch are destroyed. Head. All right. So that was cool. Mm-hmm. So we can do something else. And you see, I did not move the cloud, you know. Yeah, but you get there's so much you can do. Just let your imagination run. You get a different design, you know. Uh, what else comes from clouds? Aha! Kid Dynamite! Yep. Mm-hmm. The zigzag. Look at that. Mm-hmm. All right. So let's get to some bugs. Some creepy crawlies. You're gonna do this Black Widow. Mm. You know, not mm-hmm. hard. No, that don't look too hard. That's tight. Circle, 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 circle. Mm-hmm. And some lines. Mm-hmm. So let's get started, shall we? We shall. We go. And please subscribe if you wanna see more lessons from Nick the Artist. That's N I C T H E A R T I S T. Nick the Artist, no K. No K. You can find some of my children's books that I've illustrated over the years. Mm-hmm. Um, Google, Amazon, uh, Lulu, CreateSpace, different places. I have murals all over Los Angeles. All right, so we want to put the two circles, we put the fangs in. We want to circle eyes. The thing about spiders, sometimes they have like a whole bunch of eyes. Mm-hmm. You put three eyes, you mm-hmm. know. Make these legs with some straight lines. Right now we're just putting the lines in. Mm-hmm. We're gonna do the other side so we know we're balanced. And that's okay for now. We can make it a little bit better. We're gonna close up these lines, make the legs a little bit thicker. Don't worry about going over because we have an eraser, right? Mm-hmm. Right, right. You can put hair on the legs if you want. But Mr. Nick, I want to use a marker. Nick can't we'll use a marker. You finish. He can't use you a marker. Can use, why won't you use a marker? You can use a marker later. He can't use a marker right now. Wait till you finish. After why you use finish. A marker? After you finish, you use a marker. All right. You know why I don't use a marker right away? Why? Because we need to do some erasures, okay? We need to erase some unnecessary lines, mm-hmm. okay? You can't do that with your marker. Add it. Mm-hmm. All right. So erase, 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 erase. Uh, that leg's looking kind of... Mm. Needs help. Mm, looks like a little help. I'm gonna leave it. Alone. Yeah, it needs help, Mr. Nick. That leg needs some help. Looks a little suspect though. Mm-hmm. Do you do it better? So we're gonna put the Black Widow symbol, which is pretty much two triangles, mm-hmm. on top of each other. And pretty much there we go. Into the spider. Enter the spider. All right, I'll show you another quick one, real quick. This is a, a easier one. Same concept though. Just two big circles. 
circle around I made the legs a little bit easier right here. See, you do that. Or you can make that into a crab. Circle. It doesn't have to be a spider. Just put around three legs man. on each side instead of four. And a big claw on the, in the front, you know. But the more detail your work, the better it looks, the stronger it looks. Circles around me. Our circle eyes. And we bring out the magic eraser. Nice. 40 to 50% of artwork is erasing and going over and erasing and going over and erasing and going over. Don't throw away your papers. If you make a mistake, erase, erase, and if you can't use that side, turn it to the back. Just flip it over. I don't want to eat. I don't like my work. Don't need to waste time. Just flip your paper over. Plus, you want to see your progress. Look at the coloring. Okay, see? So let's move away from creepy crawlies into more of a beautiful oh, flower. Look at her. She got a little bumblebee. So let's see if we can draw her. Again, we use circles. Circle for the face. For the flower. We need circles for the petals mm -hmm. of the flower. Mm -hmm. You got me going in circles. Wah, wah, wah. Another circle there. Okay. Let's go with the stem. Ah, got now we shut the flower first. The petals. The stem All right. and that. circle what 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 else what else what else what else another ah, stinger but we're gonna add another circle and what else circle mm -hmm. all right cool this color you know nice nice so this is a happy flower yeah with a little happy bee mm -hmm. hello mr flower i'm gonna sting you i'm gonna get your palate to sting you Hello, Mr. B. All right. I'm going to poison you. I'm going to give you Corona. Kind of flying crazy. Now let's go ahead and put some personality on this flower. Let's make her beautiful. Mm-hmm. Give me a nice smile. Some nice eyelashes, please. Mm-hmm. So pretty. Ready for my picture, Mr. Devil. So pretty. Let's add some color. Mm -hmm. It's springtime. Time to color. Let's see, I'm gonna do green. Well, get my colors together. I need yellow. I need some fuchsia. See that? Try and stand in lines when you color. I know they say, Jesus, go outside the lines. But first, you got to know the line to color in before you can color outside the line. You know, so you want to know how to color in that line. That way, you can go outside the line and color. You know what I'm saying? Because if you color outside the line before you color inside the line, you don't know how to go outside the line. So you want to color inside the line so you can color outside the line later on. But first, you want to color inside the line. All right, you know what I'm saying? Are you confused? Just color in the line. And I don't like scratchy, scribbly colors. All my students know Mr. Nick does not like scratchy or scribbly or scratchy or scribbly. Left is a pattern, a pattern. I like it. Full of color. Put some color on your paper. Put some color on your paper. Don't worry, it looks nice. 
Just go, put color, put some color on your paper, put some color on your paper. If you're tired, then pause and come back later. Put color on your paper, be a good neighbor, put color on your paper. All right, it's looking good. Put some color in the bumblebee. So that was too hard, was it? You just threw a flower in a bumblebee in the springtime. Yeah, it came out nice. At least I like it. And that's all that matters. You never I know what you can do unless you try. My picture, I like it. All right, let's see if we can get one more in. Okay. And please subscribe if you want to see more art lessons. I have um, different levels of art um, from beginning to more advanced. So I uh, want to thank Escuela Plus students for tuning in. Dr. Russell, thank you. Ms. Lewis Class, I see you. into a dog, uh, uh, yeah, all types a of panda, koala, a polar monkey, bear, uh, a cat, you know, up to you, a little gerbil, something, a teddy bear, oh. a bear, but I did like monkey, I like, like, uh, like gizmo. You guys don't know about Gizmo. You guys are too young for Gizmo. 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 All right. So we're going to work on our little Gizmo Munchie Chi. You don't know what a Munchie Chi is. You don't know nothing about Munchie Chi. Munchie Chi. You don't know nothing about that. Uh, None about kind that. Kind of curious right now. Curious George-ish. You don't know nothing about Curious George. You don't know nothing about no Curious George either. Alright. I know Curious George, Mr. Nick. Nice. I didn't like that one. So you can create your own character. If you want to make your own stories. Um... The world is yours. The world is mine. We have the time now. So get to writing. The world is mine. Get to drawing. Get to imagining. The world is mine. Get off TikTok. Get off Fortnite. Get off that TikTok! And get to work. Put on some nice music. And get out there and draw. Paint, relax, right. color. Nice stuff color on the mouth. You can put teeth in, give them buck teeth, uh, put a tongue in, you can close the mouth, you know, give them a frown. It's up to you. It's your monkey. Give them some fangs. Chia pet. Give them like some fangs and a scar. Gizmo thingy. You tell me what it is. Call him Conrad. Okay. Oh, no. I don't like so. Conrad. About to get our eraser in a minute. I think I pretty much have every. Call him Sherrington. I like about it. Go ahead and start erasing. Sherrington Mungo. Need some of this unnecessary space. How about shine? Okay. Monkey shine. Mm -hmm. No, I don't like that one. Either. Monkey shine. How about brass monkey? The funky monkey. Look at him. 
So sophisticated. Such a distinguished monkey. Or Crass monkey. Chupacabra. Or that funky monkey. Dripper. I will call you Roscoe. Roscoe? Roscoe Pennington. Roscoe the third. Pennington. Ah, okay. He owns the monkey business. All right, Roscoe. When you say stop all that monkey business, that's Roscoe. He fired you. He said stop all that When you monkey. add like names and stuff to your characters or to your drawings, then you, you let your mind create other things. He lives his monkey bill. All the monkeys and the chimps. And the Aiko Roscoe Pennington the third. I might put a, a suit on him. He's, he's a businessman. Monkey business. I might have him ride a, a scooter or something. I don't know. A monkey Roscoe scooter. Pennington the third. That's how you get around. That's how you get around. You get home what does your monkey do? Mine rides scooters all day long. Possibly. All right. Put my stamp on it. Nick the artist. Please subscribe. Okay, cool. Let's see if we have time for one more. Uh, I think I'll do a unicorn or something. Okay, all right, 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 so we use circle head, circle face. Make a little smile. Make some mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. lines. You can always pause if you need to. Mm -hmm. I'm just kind of rushing through this one. You know, if I want my lunch break. Mm -hmm. So I'm about to. Yeah. Teachers gotta take a break too. Yeah. You gotta cook. There right, we go. With the, ah, there we go. Signature mm -hmm. unicorn. And we mm -hmm. put the hair in. Don't worry about some of these lines because we're going to erase. Mm-hmm. See that? It's a nice little tail. You can make it puffy. You can Bushy make it tail. curly. Bushy tail. All right, I'm going to put a little shadow legs, background, a little kick. Make it look like it's walking or something. Doing a unicorn or stomping in the AM. Unicorn half step. There we go. Stop in the yard. Yeah, color this in. Make that unicorn background. stomp. Stop in the yard. Stay in the lines. That unicorn stomp. Stop in the yard. Tell me what that to unicorn do. stomp. I mean, tell me what to do, but don't tell me what to do. I mean, but tell me what to do, but don't tell me what to do. I mean, but don't tell me what to do. I mean, but don't tell me what to do. But don't tell me what to do. All right. So you can keep it like that, but I'm not feeling it. It was just something in my head that popped uh, up. I'm thinking about. You try. Go ahead and take this out. Hey, that's light. But you know, you can keep it or elaborate on it. It's up to you. It's your world. I'm getting rid of it. It's your art. Be gone. I'm just gonna take mine out. You shall be removed. I like them apples. Get away from my presence. Disappear. All right. And this concludes. Our lesson for enjoyed. today. See I'd like to thank time. you and please subscribe and tune me in next time. Booyah. See ya. Pop.